Hi, right, what's going on guys? Bear Coverage Gaming. Today I'm going to be modding Halo Wars Definitive Edition on the PC. I'm going to be showing you guys how to mod Halo Wars. So let's get into it. So you're going to start off with the file explorer. And you're going to go ahead and click which drive you want to use. I'm going to be using my SSD drive today. And I'm going to create a folder called Halo Wars Mods. So we're going to download all your mods into. Then after that, you're going to go to view. And make sure that you have hidden items check marks so you can see app data. And you're going to go to your C drive. You're going to go to users. You're going to go to your username. You're going to go to app data, which you couldn't see before because it wasn't check marked in view. So you're going to click on that. You're going to go to local. You're going to find Halo Wars and you're going to want to pin it to your quick access. So you can find it for later. So you don't have to constantly do that all the time. And then you're going to go ahead and open that. You're going to go to new, create text document, call it mod manifest. Okay, and then we're going to use this for later. So then you can go ahead and close that. And then in the description below, I put a two websites that you can use. You can use Nexus or you can use mod DB. Okay, so this has a bunch of mods on it. Nexus has not very much mods on it, but it's doable. So today I'm just going to be using Flood vs. Rebels as an example. Uh, you're going to go ahead and click the manual download. Click slow download. And you need to make sure that you have an account on Nexus. And then after that, you can open up that. And then you're going to go back to your file explorer. Go to Halo Wars Mods. And then you're just going to simply drag and drop Flood vs. Rebels into the Halo Wars mods or whatever mod you're using. And then once you get that going, you just simply click on the uh, file, open the file, and then copy and paste the address of the mod. And then go to your C drive. Um, well, no, go to your quick access. Oh, I forgot about it. And then go ahead and paste and save. Now, I'm not 100% sure if you can use more than one mod at a time because I am pretty new at modding Halo Wars, but so far I got this working. So, yeah. So, anyways, you can go ahead and run your game now. And then you're just going to go to skirmish and there we go. I'm the flood and there's the rebels. So I'll go ahead and start the game and show you guys a little bit of what's going on here. So there I am. I'm the flood and I can spawn in a bunch of infected forms. Looks like I have two heavy supply pads and uh, I'm kind of spawner in the back here. I'm not really too sure. But uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's about it, guys. For the flood, anyways. And I'll show you guys the. The. Uh, the, the rebels. So, the rebels. Sorry, I've never played on the PC on Halo Wars, uh, so I'm trying to get used to the controls here. So it appears that I am Covenant, but I have Rebels to spawn in, I guess. Uh, I'm going to build like a factory summit in a hall. Probably should have built the temple first. But it looks like I have some rebels here. You guys get the point. It's rebels and flood. I guess he just didn't. Uh, the mod creator didn't create a uh, rebel base. They, they just had to use the covenant. I don't know. Um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.